Hi folks, I've got a couple Lionel items that I'm going to unbox today. And uh, I'll be doing reviews on one of them later. One of them I've already done a review on. This is just a two-car expansion pack. And then the other is a set. So, let's go ahead and open these up. And Chessie's joining us today for the unboxing. There he is. Chessie! Meow! <laughs> there he is. You ready to unbox these, Chessie? You ready? Yeah. All right. So, this is the Lionel Scale State Set add-on two-pack. So, the pre-war inspired state set that I reviewed a few weeks ago, this is the two-car add-on pack that I talked about. I went ahead and got it so that the set would be complete. So, to open these boxes, Today, I'm going to be using my Willemson Ready. Pretty cool looking knife. So let's go ahead and open up the two pack first. Is that okay, Chessie? There's the tag. Lionel Scale State Set Add-on 2-Pack. Baggage Car and Station Sounds Diner. Diner car plays announcements when moving and stopped. 054 minimum curve. Unfortunately, the 2-car add-on pack doesn't come in a pre-war style box like the main set did. But it's okay. You can't win them all. Jesse, look at that. So there's the Michigan baggage car. It's always more difficult than you think to film these unboxings. Because you drop stuff or... Stuff doesn't want to open up. It's not as easy as you'd think. So there it is, the Michigan baggage car. And unlike California, they spelled Michigan correctly. Very cool. And this is the other boring stuff you don't see during these unboxings is me reboxing the empty boxes. <laughs> Isn't this exciting? <laughs> Putting an empty container back in its box. Maybe I'll start doing reboxing videos too. <laughs> All right, and then this is the North Carolina Station Sounds car. I guess Chessie got bored. And there that is. I like it how this whole speaker thing is red. <laughs> That's awesome. And it looks like they spelled North Carolina correctly, too. Very cool. Now, with both cars, you get the soft rubber diaphragms that you can add on if you want to. I imagine the reason they're not attached by default is because if you run these cars on really tight curves like 054, it might cause these diaphragms to knock up against each other and possibly derail the cars. Ooh, and look at that sweet, sweet reboxing. All right, here's the second item we're going to unbox, and this is the George H.W. Bush funeral train. So, a little more exciting than the two-pack we just opened up. And check that out. That's awesome. It's even got the seal of the president. And 
And there it is. It's quite an attractive box. And just in case you don't know, in the real world, a few years ago when George H.W. Bush died, they did actually do a funeral train. It was done by the Union Pacific. So this is actually based on a real train. You can see here it's got the SD70 and then four passenger cars. City of Portland dome car, Overland dining car with station sounds, Kennefick business car, and Council Bluffs baggage car with the American flag on it. And once we get inside the box, it's not quite as fancy, it's just your standard buy and L boxes. So we'll go ahead and open up the engine. There's the tag. UP Legacy SD70 ACE 4141. Legacy control, Bluetooth control, Legacy rail sounds, fan driven smoke, dual electrocouplers, 036 minimum curve. I wonder if this has custom sounds for the funeral train. If it was MTH, I would say probably Lionel. I don't know. We'll find out. And there it is. Why, right, what a beauty. Still has the protective foam on it. Let me get that off. And there it is. Boy, what a beauty. That is a nice looking SD70. All right, and we'll open up one of the passenger cars as well. And this is the City of Portland dome car. Oh, and these actually have passengers on the inside. Wow, that's awesome. Typically, these 21-inch passenger cars do not have passengers, so that is a nice bonus. I'll be doing a full review on this set in the near future, so stay tuned for that. In the meantime, I'll run this by the camera a couple times, as well as the pre-war state set with the two added cars. So that's it for now. I'm Eric Siegel. Enjoy the view, and I'll see you next time.